Starting with that, then um, tell us a little about NBA ENT. Shit, man. NBA ENT, it came from. I made it up. Nah, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Here's my manager. You know what I mean? He came up with the idea. You know what I mean? So, it's like NBA. I'm not going to freak this shit out. Pause for like five, five or ten minutes. He looked at me, I said, What? He said, Never broke again. I'm like, Damn. You know what I mean? So, like me, bro, I came up. I don't know that, you know what I mean? So for me to, to be where I'm at, it's a blessing, you know what I mean? So I came like from another area and some of my mixtapes, and I ran to my manager, you know what I'm saying? And uh, I get in my CD, I was like, you know what I mean? He was like, he knows some people, you know what I mean? So I was like, where, who you know? He was like, Soup. So shit, next thing I know, we gave my CD to Soup. Shit. He, my manager called me, he was like, you come over here, I got Hollis. I'm like, what's wrong? I like, just wanna talk to him. So I was like, all right, bet. Over there, like he was like uh, sitting on the side. I'm like, shit. Bro, I was like, where? Good shit. Bro, trying to give me goddamn some bread for an uh, artist deal. I was like, just keep the bread, bro. You know what I'm saying? Man, this shit loyalty of the war. You know what I'm saying? I don't want it. You know what I mean? We're gonna do this shit together. So, shit. Once we got that squared away, we came over the name. Shocker World Proud Us. You know what I'm saying? And then the rest is history, bro. I'm on tour. You know what I'm saying? I got three labels behind me. Shocker World ENT, NBA ENT. They got no limit back in there. New mixtape, that shit about to drop. I say by the end of July. My new, um, I got a new song called Is What It Is, you know what I'm saying? So everybody stay tuned. We got a lot of shit popping off. We got this reality show with Fox Network. About six more months, I'm gonna start shooting on. And then um, just go from there, man. Like, I got a lot of, I got a lot of deals with the process, you know what I mean? So I'm trying to get a lot of endorsement deals. So I need all the endorsement deals I can get, man. Y'all can holler at me, man. Okay. I'm the one for you. Well, we see you recently at um, Essence Festival, Celebrity Weekend, the NBA basketball tournament, all that. Yeah, yeah. So, um, what's the love and life for you out in New Orleans? Shit, man. It's crazy out here, man. You know what I'm saying? I was um, trying to do celebrity basketball games with my CEO. Bro gave me the, um, he gave me my outfit to play with. You know what I mean? My shorts were like so small, I couldn't squeeze in. <laughs> so, I was like, damn, I can't even, like, spend this on a nigga, man. You know what I mean? So, shit, I just, it's like, Shot my regular shorts I had on, nigga was like, I can't play, you know what I'm saying? I gotta put on a uniform, so once I did that, I was like, alright, bet. Bro just told me I got that on my ground, so that's what I did, you know? And, um, so we see you with um, a lot of different celebrities and stuff out there. Can you speak on any um, collaborations? Do you get to cut up with anybody? Um, yeah, we seen that you mentioned you may be doing some stuff with Kodak Black. Yeah, I, had, um, I seen Kodak at the game. I'm hollering at him in the back, you know what I'm saying? He's shocking right this I got some of work young school coming out. I got some of old days beast man. Um, I just leaned up with um, DJ Issa, two chains, um, DJ man. All that hell that we did. Probably get that squared away. Shit man, just school man. I got mixtapes online right now. Uh, LiveMixtape.com. What's that one? Legacy. What's that mixtape called? Um, True Story. I got one called Now nah, Never. I got one called Life of a Go Get. Life of the Go Get is what got me my deal in the limit. You know what I'm saying? It's out of right now. A couple years old, if you listen to it, it's still sound like it right now. You know what I'm well, that's why I think we, we love even with your sound. You got that rawness and that realness that a lot of us that we came upon that No Limit sound. Yeah. People want that authentic street music, and we hear that from you. We didn't hear the records yeah. you got with Sub. You, you know what I'm saying? Like, my voice, a lot of people say I sound like X, DMX. People fail to realize my voice, my style, came from fame, used to walk off. You know what I'm saying? 
that's like everything that comes from listening to him, listen to me, you hear where it come from, you know what I mean? So, and hey, you know what? That's real because not a lot of artists um, get back that support to say, you know, who they was inspired by and stuff like that. So um, we definitely hear that. Um, so okay, in terms of um, just the new direction that you be going with your music and stuff, um, we know that we got the old No Limit then reunion stuff going on. Um, could we expect to hear you cutting up with someone? Yeah, yeah man. Um, you know, I'm gonna uh, bring sick out for any show that we do, you know what I'm saying, on the tour. Um, once we do that right there, we keep it moving. Like, we got a couple shows coming up, you know what I'm saying, just Google the uh, Shocking Way and TV, they think pop up all the information to you, you know, you know what I'm saying, for the label, for what we got going on, you know what I'm saying, you know, you go to uh, Sip and Shocker, we got a new single out called Allergies, you gotta check it out, man, not the thing is true right now. And you got the new um, book out, right, Pave? Yeah, you got a new book out, Pave, you know what I'm saying, I'm teaching everybody how to not to put big stuff in the game, you know what I'm saying, I learned before you get to jump in. It's about, it's about paperwork, what it is about it. You know what I'm saying? That's it, man. You gotta get the paperwork right for me. So, even on that note, what advice would you give to like, the young artists coming up? Stay prayed up, man. Hold it down the best way you can. I mean, stay at it. It's about to happen sooner or later. You know? It's already planned to happen, it's happen anyway. So, take your clothes to work. Anytime you can't feel like you can't make it, sit so me. I win. So, I'm like, what's that? Oh, it makes sense later. Pay attention to it.